You welcome back. This is Breakfast Daily. Now you know that um, almost th there are issues, you know, and um, uh, things. Uh, meeting people would normally depend on certain things that bring you together. Now um, you'd be amazed that this gentleman you are going to be talking to. You know, I have so much love for him. I have so much respect for him for the amazing stuff that he is doing. Now this is what brought us together. You know, so some time back. Um, I don't even know what happened. I just got a call from a certain gentleman who told me that, okay, so I want to bring you some <laughs> I believe he like, no, why David, why is this not thing coming out? Why, what are you doing? Because I won't frame it. David me fro. <laughs> you know, so um he brought me no please. So he brought me um ice cream, you know. This is what we call our ice cream, you know, but it is, yeah. Where there's a will, there's a way, right? So he brought me this, I tasted it, and from then on, we became family. Ladies and gentlemen, there's no party that you not find this gentleman. And to think that something as basic as Abile, you know, something that we all know, somebody can really turn the fortunes of Abile around, create a very solid business out of it, and now Abile Delight has become a household name. But hey, you know, sometimes your, your good work precedes you. We know the product, we know Ability Delight, but we know the brain behind this. This conversation is with the man who has created this wonderful <laughs> brand, and he's going to tell us how he did this, who he is, and how come he's giving us something that we'll forever be proud of. This is Breakfast Daily. I do say you're welcome. Hi, Firma. Thank you very much. <laughs> yeah. Happy to be here. <laughs> awesome. Great to have you. You know, so David is going to be doing... Um, the talking. All the talking. talking. <laughs> Whilst you do all the eating. I will be demonstrating, <laughs> you know. Over back to you, David. Wow. <laughs> yeah. Tell me, how are you doing? I'm doing well. It's good I'm to have well you here. It's good to I'm have happy you to be here. Good morning now, to you. I know you wear different hats, but today we are focusing on Ability Delight. Right. Um... How did this whole thing begin? Because, I mean, I remember as kids, mm -hmm. I mean, this was something that, you know, people would be passing by and then you call and then, I don't know even know how much it was in those days, you know, but every, every child had some coins to be able to buy some. You no, know, sometimes and, you have to save it. Uh, well, yes, exactly, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah you know, um, but how did this then occur to you that it could be a business? Um, good morning once again, uh, David Fremer. Um, before I answer your question, mm -hmm. I'd like to chip in something very important. Mm -hmm. um, this business that you see here, mm -hmm. this wonderful treat that you are having, yeah. it was conceptualized by somebody very special. Okay. okay. I'll confess mm -hmm. that I am not the brain. Oh, <laughs> wow. Okay. Somebody had a dream. Mm -hmm. And I was lying by that person. Hey, <laughs> hey. Such lies are strategic No, lies. you are the inspiration <laughs> of that dream. You know, because while you sleep, yeah. will inform the kind of dreams Dream you will have. You know, like, people get dreams and lions are chasing them. Yes. <laughs> that yes. they are carrying yes. their eyes at the port. You know. But somebody had a dream and good. it was ice cream. Good. No, people should be lying next to you. I know, right? that, I know, you know right? that kind of dream, you know. Right. So the truth is, mm -hmm. my wife. Mm. Wait, what's your wife's name? Her name is Susanna Yeboa Brenya. Susanna. Okay. Susanna Yeboa Brenya. She conceptualized. Oh, that's Madame okay. on screen. Right. <laughs> no, 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 Susan, you are an asset to this yeah, country. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You are a yeah, great yeah. asset to Ghana. Yeah. A very beautiful lady. Yes. She is. Yes, yes, yes. She's the one who conceptualized this whole idea. Mm. You know, um, from the very beginning, I must be honest, when she spoke to me about it, I was a bit, you know, skeptical. Mm. I said, oh, I believe, dear, I mean... I believe, dear. So I was a bit skeptical. I wasn't in agreement from the very beginning. But, you know, the business-minded person as I am, mm. I sat back, I crunched a few numbers. I was working in my office. I opened an Excel sheet, put some few figures together, did some few projections, and I realized that, look, um, Business is all about solving people's needs yeah. and then taking things to people. Mm. Things that people would normally not want to stress about to go looking out for. Yeah. If you're able to provide it for them, they'll be willing to, you know, mm. take out yeah. something, you know, to pay for it. No matter how small, mm. you get it. Mm. Even the ocean has rain falling yes, into it. So exactly. no matter how small, eventually it will accumulate into mm. something big. 
So I, I came back to her and I said, okay, it's a fantastic idea. Yeah. I want to be a co-owner <laughs> of the idea. Wow. We put our minds together. She does the production. I do the, the marketing okay. and then all, you know, all the okay. sorts. So we, 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 we work together okay. in putting up, wow. bringing out this wonderful wow. delicacy, mm. this delightful, wow. You it, know, is, it is quite that you delightful, have. actually, yes. I must admit. Yes. I mean, for yes. me, yes. I, I, I favor more the strawberry and the chocolate, those two flavors. Mm. All, because, I mean, <laughs> they are deadly flavors. All, mm. all, the, all the flavors yeah. are, are mm. wonderful. And just like, oh, 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 you enjoy it, you know, it's just by just yourself. Hold it from me. <laughs> no, you said you, said you uh, uh, favor with us. <clears throat> I said the chocolate, the coffee, mm. and then the strawberry. <laughs> You're going to look for some. I want to see there's coffee or something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, so, so, so. Kweku actually spoke to me on the side mm -hmm. and said, look, you know my favorite, you know my favorites already. So please yeah. make sure that mm -hmm. I have my favorites ready and waiting. So oh, it so will be in it? there. Definitely in there. Okay. No, I want to, I, I just want to confirm. You, you, want, you want to <laughs> see whether the, the coffin is true. Eh? But no, no. If it, <laughs> will try it? No, no, you have to try it. I want you uh, to try it. Okay. So no, 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 I'm not Paula is trying to, you know. No, no, I'm not, I'm not eating yet. Though. Okay, no oh, problem. Uh, it's, no, it's all right, it's all right. Mm, but, but, yeah. but, but, you know but, why, you know why. Mm -hmm. Mine, he has brought me a pack. That's a bridge <laughs> from here. Fema, I, I, I realized you, you struggled a bit in, in taking it out. No, because uh, it's, it's, yeah, it's, yeah. it's frozen. Yeah, it's frozen. So it's an art. Form. You just, yeah. you just uh, it's completed not like speaking a, about the it's art. It's not school of performing art. So, Mr. David. Art is art. There, mm, ah, there are okay. two ways <laughs> of <laughs> getting this thing out of the cup. Okay. Right. One is by rubbing it, you yes. know, giving some so, friction, some so heat. So you heat, you heat the sides and exactly. it starts to melt. You see, uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Exactly. Sides, it starts to melt and then it becomes easy to Well, you are a science student, so you know how to um, <laughs> apply heat this and is, friction and stuff artistic like that. Part of now, science. we from the arts background, yeah. you know how to eat it artistically. <laughs> you got it? Right. I got but, it. But how has the response been like, you know, since you brought this onto the market? How have Guardians received this? Okay, so I'll take it back to the question on how it all came about. Yeah. So, um, um, when she. But this is nice, the coffee. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Yes. Cheers. Yes, so yes, and you, you can taste actual coffee in there I'm because a fan of coffee, there's so, that infusion yeah. of yeah, coffee in yeah. there, so you taste it. We try to make it as natural as possible. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. So um, one time, um, she she went. We went for this family gathering, right? After she had conceived the whole idea, mm -hmm. we went for this family gathering, and then uh, she made some few, mm. you know. Um, I, I don't think we had all these flavors available. I think no. she made just about two flavors mm -hmm. and everybody was scrambling for it. Mm. It was at that time when I was still doubting Thomas. Okay. Mm. You get it. Okay. But everybody was scrambling for it. Everybody wanted to have a feel of it. And everybody was, you know, praising the fact that it was, it was fantastic. Mm. I mean, like you rightfully said earlier, it's available on the markets, yeah. on the street. Yeah. People still do them. Mm. But then she sat down and thought about how she was going to make it better, mm -hmm. make it richer, mm -hmm. and then make it healthier. If you realize when you're consuming, the sugar levels are extremely no, low. Exactly. And people have a lot of concern yeah. about, about sugar, sugar these days. Yeah. So she sat down and then, you know, she thought about, you know, how to formulate it, you know, formulate it yeah. and make it good. Yeah. So when I saw the reaction by the family members, I was like, okay, this is a sample mm -hmm. right here. Mm -hmm. So if they are receptive, if, if, if they like what they are tasting, mm -hmm. then it, it means if it goes out there, yeah. we are going to see a similar kind mm -hmm. of reception. Exactly. We're going to receive yeah. a similar kind mm -hmm. of reception. So that's when it started. Wow. I put on my, th my, think my, my thinking cap. Yep. Yep. I went out there. I started speaking to people. People were very warm, people were very receptive. And I mean, business is all about networking. Yeah, yeah. If people, you don't warm up to people, people mm -hmm. don't receive you yeah. well, you are not able to move from where you are to where you want yeah. to be. And the likes of Firma, wonderful people, yourself, <laughs> I mean, and you see, the truth is, the product also speaks for itself. Yes. Absolutely, that's, that's, that's what I was going to say. Yeah, you know? That's the and, biggest and part for me. Abele has a very, um, um, cool sport in everybody's hearts. Mm. You know, if you mm, go yeah. up in Ghana, yeah. you understand this. Yeah. And for me, that is the excitement and the yeah. memories that yeah. it, it, it comes the with. Nostalgia. You know, yeah. exactly. nostalgia is yeah. the magic. Yes, it works every yes. single time. Yes, you know, yes. You when people see it, 
especially people who are you know older, older yeah. when they see they're like ah this thing yeah from this thing this <laughs> thing oh some people say oh me a tea yeah. i pour the tea into the cup i freeze it yeah. exactly I, you know <laughs> so people wonder that how did you think about it mm. it was just a basic idea mm. it was just a basic idea that we put the mark the numbers yeah. together and then yeah. you know you know so going into this as a business you know that people come out of school yeah. and everybody is looking at being employed by somebody mm. how do we turn this around how do we change the narrative by people going into um, businesses that might not necessarily demand huge capital because i'm sure this was not capital intensive like that no. you know no. how do we go no. about it no see um it's the perception mm. it's a perception and um the way our schooling process is for me I never dreamt or I never thought I'd be sitting here talking about a belly. Yeah. Mm. I wanted to wear suit and tie. Yes. Okay. You know, that's okay. where yeah. the, the respect, yes. mm -hmm. you know, in a, quote. Is it a you, brand here? <laughs> exactly. Yeah, crouching. Exactly. Yeah. Exactly. And so it's like immediately you're out of school, you are looking or you're scrambling for the next available job, mm -hmm. taking CVs here and there and all that. When somebody talks about you doing something for yourself or starting something for yourself, the immediate thing that comes into your head is, where am I going to get the money from? Exactly. Mm. Capital, yeah. this. But you see, um, it's, 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 it's about starting it from a very small and manageable yeah, level. face level. or yeah. level. Yeah. You get it. Then when you are able to solidify yourself, mm you can scale up gradually. Yeah. You don't have to start on a massive scale. Yeah. You get it? Yeah. Because there are a lot of businesses which started on tables yeah. and yeah. kiosks yeah. and, you know, yeah. but today yeah. they are on levels that, you know, are un in, uh, uh, unimaginable. Mm. I mean, they wouldn't have even thought about it yeah. from the time they started. Mm. So yes, we started on a very small level. Mm. Um, truth is, if you, um, th this program that you did at Aviation Social Center, yes. yeah. I've forgotten the exact um, name. The Made in Ghana, Ghana Fair. Fair. Yes, the Made in Ghana yeah. Fair. The Made in Ghana Fair. Yeah. That was our biggest exposure. As at that time, we had now started, we were just, you know, selling to few friends and family. Then I heard about the program, mm. I registered. Truth is, when we were coming in, we came in very small. Mm -hmm. I think we came with about 200 pieces with no expectation whatsoever yeah. mm. to even sell out those yeah. 200 pieces. Mm -hmm. I must be honest with you. By a little after midday, 1 p.m., it was gone. Everything was gone. Mm. Mm. Everything was gone. Yeah. You get it. Mm. And people were actually hacking. They wanted to beat us. <laughs> you know, they were like, ah, are you guys serious? Are you, exactly. are you serious with business? I mean, you're coming to a place like this. And we had no place, idea. Exactly, yeah. We had no yeah. idea. No, share your experience with us as well with Back to Your Village Food Bazaar. Amazing. Amazing. Absolutely so, amazing. So after the Made in Ghana yeah. experience, yes. what was your preparation like for this one? So, mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> we went back. We looked at the numbers that came for that particular program. Um, they were in their hundreds. So we anticipated that this is going to be on a similar yeah. scale. Yeah. So back two years ago, or was it three years ago well, that, that we did? Two years ago. Yeah. Two years ago yeah. that we did 200 pieces. Mm -hmm. This time around, we said, look, we are at a scale where people, the demand has risen. Mm -hmm. So we are targeting a thousand to a thousand five hundred pieces. Are okay. you kidding me? Okay, okay, I like it. A thousand mm -hmm. to a thousand five hundred pieces from two hundred. No, a thousand to a thousand five. Yes, and uh, so we came in. I came early in the morning. Mm -hmm. yeah. The boss was at home. Mm -hmm. I call her the boss. Of course, yeah. <laughs> they the say boss we had every successful man. <laughs> yeah. A boss woman. Yeah. Right. Yeah. The boss was at home. You know, ready to you know give me um, 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 backup mm -hmm. just in case I run yeah. out. So I came with so a thousand. So this was Saturday or Sunday? This was Saturday. Okay. The, the very the first Thursday. day. A thousand pieces. Okay. It started 9 a.m., 10 a.m. People started trooping in. From 11 a.m., mm -hmm. I didn't have, have time to even drink water or even eat. Wow. Constantly, constantly, people were on us buying. Constantly. <laughs> and by the same time, yeah. 1 p.m. or 2 p.m. It was done. It was gone. A thousand pieces. It was gone. Gone by 2 p.m. It was gone. Wow. <laughs> it was gone. 
City FM crew alone at half. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no, as for the lady, like that's, you need, you need a, uh, oh, no, thank you, you need a I mean, the support, City. the support from City, Successful you know, business. patronage and all yeah. that, mm. you know, it was gone. So mm -hmm. I immediately had to ring her up, and then she mobilized the the five hundred pieces. Yeah, we could have brought more, but the thing is, if we bring more. Sunday, yeah, yeah. there will be enough. shortage, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, and it takes time for it to, you know, to freeze and we that. didn't know that. Look, we will sell out a thousand five hundred in a matter of hours. Yeah. hours. So, yeah, in a matter of hours. Uh -huh. So, in the the, uh, the dispatch guy had to go on a bike. He quickly, you know, mobilized, brought yeah. it to us, and I was looking at the, the that one hour to two hours that I was sitting idle. Yeah. People come in, they talk Billy, and I was like, hey, Charlie, all this money going. <laughs> I know, <laughs> this right? Money going. <laughs> When it got there, mm -hmm. all the people we are told to mm. wait and you know for they're some, more. they came rushing in. That wow. 500 finished within an hour, wow. and it was gone. No, I had to wow. sneak out because when because people saw like, me yeah, leaving, yeah, you know, yeah. you know. And then day two, day two, same, same story. Thousand five. Thousand five hundred. So pieces. in two days, three thousand pieces, pieces sold out. And and truth is, we could have sold more, more mm -hmm. yeah. because. If we 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 finished selling around 4 p.m. Yeah. between 4 p.m. and 6 p.m., yes. the crowd was still massive. Yeah. Yeah. People were still True. trooping in. Yes. Yes. It was a it was a massive success. Yeah. Mm. It was a massive mm. success. Mm. I'm telling you. you maybe, maybe you should you, bring us some more money. You didn't. Be, <laughs> <laughs> you didn't dream of this thing day. Is, no, I I I when I, she first when she I mean put it together when she I first didn't. mentioned it and selling out 3,000 pieces. I I didn't. I didn't. Like Aileon said, when she said Abele, when she said ice cream, I was like, okay. No, when she, she I'm broke it down to Abele, we were like, are you for real? Abele. Oh, <laughs> like, <Madame>. seriously. <laughs> Abele. I, you know, yeah. You know, so yeah. I, 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 we, I, let me not say I, mm -hmm. we didn't dream mm. that we'll get to this stage mm. because, I mean, starting in our living room. Yeah with a small freezer, mm -hmm. which produces about 100 to 200 pieces, which mm. will sell over one week or two weeks, yeah. to now producing over a thousand pieces, which will sell within a day, like this. Yeah. So, so what would you think, you know, is the cause for people not able to advance like this with their businesses? Because you realize that a lot of people will start businesses some yeah. way, I mean, along the line, yeah. it collapses. Yeah. But you have been able to do this, sustain it. It is growing. What has been, you know, the real story behind that? Okay, so um, it's not easy mm -hmm. to be an entrepreneur. Mm. There's no lie. Mm. It's, it's not easy. There are several challenges aside, you know, financials. There are, there are several hurdles you have to overcome. Yeah. And you yourself as a person have to be psychologically, emotionally, everything ready mm. to be able to deal with all these hurdles that come your way. It is not easy at all. I mean, going out there to sell your product to people, for people to receive you and all that. Yeah. If, if you're not prepared, to hold your brand that you have developed, to hold it through thick and thin, mm. at a point in time, you give up, give up yeah. you will, mm. you know. And I think, I think I may be wrong, mm -hmm. a lot of people start businesses with the mindset of making it yeah, yeah. quick. And, you know, making money, yeah. you know, by, you overnight. know, the end of the day, overnight, mm -hmm. yeah. yes. But it's not like that. You have to go through a process. You have to churn yourself through mm. a process. Mm. You have to go through the mill. Yeah. You have to do everything possible. Mm. Look, there are times that you would run at losses. Yeah. There are times that you have to give people, you know, I, I used to drive around, I yeah. call people, I mm. say, oh, I have this ice Sample. cream for you. <laughs> Take. You know, he will bring a billet to my house, you know, and I'm like, whoa, this guy is you know, serious, man. You have, you, 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 have to do, you have to go all out. Yeah. And um, thankfully, uh, the little expertise I picked up, I worked in the corporate environment for mm -hmm. a while. So mm -hmm. little ideas that I picked up from there, you know, it helped me to be mm -hmm. able to, you know, um, um, design a sort of mm -hmm. model. Mm -hmm. Sometimes my boss is not happy with me when I pick up some packs and I say, I'm going to give to this person, yeah. I'm going to, I say, ah, 
when, how are they going to pay for it? We are losing. It's, it it is going to yeah. come back. Yeah. We're spreading the word. Exactly, it yeah. is yeah. going to come back. So it got to a time she also came to understand that yeah. oh, this thing works. You need to give you know, something. You know exactly, 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 exactly. Yeah, this is kind of easy, Yeah, exactly. So I mean, we 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 did all of that mm -hmm. without thinking of immediate profits. Mm. You get it. Mm. Let the brand establish itself. Yeah. Yeah. Then after, it would start yeah. selling itself for you. Yeah. Mm. Then you can sit yeah. back and then start counting your money. Mm. And the what 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 um, what industry were you in um, before getting into this? Okay, so um, I, I I used to be a banker. Okay, I worked uh, with Fidelity Bank for about six years. Mm -hmm. Immediately after school, okay. um, national service. Okay. And you see, <laughs> the thing about me is I've I've always liked selling things okay yeah. the people who know me yeah. today i'm selling cars tomorrow i'm selling houses the next day i'm selling perfumes mm. i'm selling watches You're selling trips <laughs> that came in <laughs> yeah. eventually <laughs> i'll talk about still that selling. one too. still selling trips yeah. yes yeah. so um when i was with the bank i was still doing these little little things mm. you know and um i worked with the um corporate um um, services of the bank and we teamed up with the marketing department a lot okay. in rolling out branches in marketing campaigns mm. so i picked up a lot mm. of those things from there from mm. you know that experience you get mm. it relationship and how to market things i picked up a lot of that experience yeah. um when i left the bank um that was around 2000, 2015 or 2016 um and i i <laughs> I'll, I'll say this, I didn't leave the bank, I was actually fired from okay. the bank. Wow. <laughs> was it part of the financial cleanup? No, What it did wasn't. you do? <laughs> <laughs> that story, I, I still haven't come to grasp with it. But, but you know, um, sometimes we say that when um, God wants you to move on to do yeah, other stuff and you do not, he will absolutely. push you. Push you, you know, push so you there up. will be a way oh, that yeah, yeah. you absolutely. have to leave me. I, I really believe leave. that. Absolutely. Whichever way yeah. you must get out absolutely. of that space. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. absolutely. Really and I want that. to take this opportunity to tell anybody who has lost their jobs or anything of that sort, not to relent. Mm. It's an opportunity for you to, you yeah, know, redefine yourself, yeah. to, mm. you know, mm. rethink your whole mm self-being mm. and then make something out yeah. of yourself right now in wrapping up you know so you have come from a place mm. where um you even doubted um how far you could go with this business yeah to a place where you were selling 200 pieces um in weeks or yeah. in days you know mm. and yeah. now you are at a place where you are selling thousands yeah. in hours yeah. let's say two years time what do you hope the story will be like okay so we are hoping now we are based in Accra. Mm -hmm. We haven't moved out of the, the, the region yet. We are hoping that in the next few years, we'll be able to establish ourselves beyond the boundaries of Accra, mm. all the way to the northern regions, mm. the southern re I yeah. mean, all the way throughout Ghana. Mm. We should mm. be in every retail outlet. Awesome. Wow. We would want to be the household name if anybody says ice cream. Yeah. Okay. Okay. It should be yeah. Abele Delight. Wow. And we, we are not going to move away from that niche that we have created. Mm -hmm. That's nostalgic yes. feel yeah. and look. Yes. No, we are going to establish ourselves that, in that same that, lane. What, what, what wood is that? Because it looks like the, the authentic trapia. <laughs> is, is that it? No, it's no, not it a trapia. It's like not a trapia. We started with the trapia. Stuff. But uh, again, the boss came up, my, my wife came up with a, fan start, a fantastic idea yeah. to use bamboo, okay. yeah. which was okay. uh, a more cheaper, yes, it's a cheaper uh, thing, you know, it's more um, alternative and yeah. sustainable. Yes. Yeah. So we, it's bamboo that okay. you're seeing. Mm. Nice. Yes. Mm. It's still yeah. healthy. Yeah. Of course. Yeah. It's still healthy. Yes. You, know, so, you know, talking about this, like uh, moving to other regions, mm. I'm just yeah. picturing um, being on Heritage Caravan, knowing that at every spot every, you have, you now get, eating you Abele Delight in Tamale would yes. be a different vibe. You know the heat in Tamale. It would happen. So, it so would if, happen. You get, if you have Abele Delight yeah. in Tamale, in Tamale. You've made that it, will, it will happen. It will <laughs> happen. And once we're able to transcend beyond mm. Accra, yeah. eventually we are going to transcend beyond the shores yeah. of Ghana. Awesome. We are working awesome. towards that. We would love yes. to see our products, you know, yes. making waves. Made in Ghana, of yes. featuring of on course. a global yeah, you know, market. And yes. you say you've done yes. awesome. And to you, Susie, 
Charlie, you are the boss chick, man. Yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank you very much for your time this morning. There's a quote that I love so much. It says that success is made of small efforts uh -huh. repeated mm. day in, day yeah. out. Yeah. Right. Yeah. And I think you are the epitome of this this quote. Yes. Yeah. Right. Brilliant. Right. Brilliant. Right. Brilliant. Well, right. I still hope that my. Oh, I'm, I can't wait to go get my, my ability. Yeah. So. Because it the way people sorted. are eyeing their yeah. ability. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't, don't give mine away. Don't give no, mine away. No, you're sorted. You're sorted. I trust you. I trust you.